I'm Kate and welcome along to this video. It's a Poundland haul. I've got lots of things to show you. It's a bit of a varied Poundland haul. I've got some Christmas gift ideas or Christmas gifts for people. I've got some like home essential bits and a couple of items I was really excited to see as well and things I'm looking forward to trying. So a bit of a varied Poundland haul and I hope you're okay. Sending lots of love to you. Hope you've had a nice week. Before I go on, I've got to do my mug of the day, which is here and I'm filming in the kitchen, which you probably, you can probably guess this is the kitchen because I'm decorating the upstairs bedroom where I normally film. So I've been painting all this week. I've got some paint on my hands. I thought it was really bad yesterday and Halloween when we went trick or treating, I had like paint all over my hands. So it looked a bit weird, but it was quite good for Halloween. But I've only got little bits. It's mostly come off and I had a shower this morning. So that probably helps. So I've been, yeah, painting up there and I've got to do some wallpaper as well. So that will be on Instagram soon, actually, that bedroom makeover thing, real, I'm good, I'm doing. So it's um, it's gonna be lovely, it's all pink and lovely and I'm using wallpaper and hopefully it'll look nice. You only sort of plan your, these ideas and you think, oh, I hope it all comes together. So fingers crossed it'll be okay. But um, yeah, that's why I am filming in the kitchen. Rufus is down here. You can't see him, he's in his bed. No, that's my mug foot of his bed. Um, he's down there having a little snore, so you may hear him snoring Rufus the dog. I'll, I'll give him the gravy bone at the end so you can see him. And before I get into the Poundland Hall, I've got to do my mug of the day and it's this lovely Emma Bridgewater one with stars on. I just fancied using this one today. It's a real dull day today. It's raining and it's really cold. Um, so yeah, I just thought I'd get a nice mug and it's not kind of, well, it's sort of, it's got stars on, so it's sort of Christmassy, but it feels November-y, this mug to me. And I think it was a free mug, actually, because I got a teapot, which is in my teapot cupboard there. It was last year or the year before, and there was a free mug with it. And I think that was the free mug anyway. So, um, yeah, that's my mug of the day. And I've got a water because I made myself a decaf coffee. I drank that because it was quite cold, because I was quite cold. And now I've just filled it up with water. So that's my mug of the day. Um, so I'm going to start off with, oh, just a couple of basic things. And hopefully I'll get all the prices right. There's a risk. I'm not sure on a couple of the things because it changes in Poundland, doesn't it? But hopefully I'll get them right. I have got a receipt here, but I've got some things at a different shop. So fingers crossed, if I get any of the prices wrong, can you just let me know in the comments and, you know, update me if I get the prices wrong. But um, I'll start off with some batteries, which are always handy, having your fairy lights on because it's getting so dark early, isn't it? So some AA batteries, they were definitely a pound. I also got some tissues, tissues, uh, which is, they're very handy, soft pocket tissues. They're really cute little patterns, there's little hearts and flowers. So I do like to have a packet of tissues on me in this weather. These are really pretty, actually. And in here you get 10, which is good. I hope these were a pound. I'm sure they were. You get 10 packets in here. Yeah, they're really cute, different ones. It's nice to have a little pretty packet of tissues, isn't it? Just, I don't know, it makes it just, it's just quite nice. So tissues, yay, put those there. I've got some socks as well, because I can't seem to find um, my smaller socks. Maybe I didn't have any, I don't know. But I want to wear some uh, with jeans and boots. And then if you have like really long socks, they you can see your socks in the jeans. Do you know what I mean? So I wanted some like ankle socks. No, these are called trainer socks. So I could like put them on, but then my boots would go on top. So you wouldn't see like jeans, sock, then boots, if you understand what I mean. So it'll just be like, you know, boots and jeans without the sock input. So I hope that makes sense. So yeah, I wanted some trainer socks that wouldn't show up on my in my my jeans and give me a clumpy bit at the bottom so these were i think they were three no 250 I thought 350 was a bit expensive in my head so two pounds 50 for these socks and there's five pairs so yes that's great some socks size four to eight and size six also got some deodorant i like the look of this one dove um Passion fruit, isn't it? Passion fruit, passion fruit and lemongrass scent. So I'm sure that's going to be lovely. So a bit of deodorant. Um, I've also got some of this laundry gel. We're doing so much washing at the moment, like with all these massive clothes, because he's really tall. Toby's growing bigger by the day. So there's just loads of clothes to wash and pyjamas and big fleecy things because I'm constantly wearing fleecy pyjamas because we've still not got the heating on. <laughs> so just trying to keep, you know, keep warm and fleecy stuff, but it's like big clumpy things to wash, aren't they? Not clumpy, but bulky, bulky fleecy things. So I got this, it's really cheap and I've used this before and actually it's it's good. Uh, this is laundry, laundry gel, non-bio, tropical sunset, more powerful formula, more powerful than maybe the previous one. Superb results, superb in a cold wash, tougher on stains. 
sounds good to me, 33 washes. And then you can just put it in here, don't you? You go, and then you chuck that in the washing machine. So that was good. I have used it before. It's £1.50. And I think that's brilliant value. How many? Uh, seven, 970 millilitres in there. Oh, sorry if I'm getting a bit close. Um, right, I'm going to save those to the end because they're like quite a nice buy. I got some of this. This is shampoo and conditioner. I don't think I've seen it before, but hopefully it's going to be good. So I've got the, you know, like the really big coconut. What's it called? It's called something. Triple eight or something. You know, like the big one they have in Poundland. The two is two pounds. I always use that. And I thought, well, this might be good because I need something that's going to boost my hair a bit. Give me a bit of volume because I love that. The two pound stuff. But the condition is so nice. It just kind of flattens my hair a bit. So I thought, well, if I need a bit of volumizing, I could I could use these. So I thought I would try them. So biotin and collagen shampoo. The make is XHC. So this is thickening shampoo and it says superfood for your hair, which is good, sounds good. Create the appearance of thicker, fuller hair. Yeah, and there is 400 millilitres in here. It says 100 millilitres extra free. That's really good. I didn't think there was 400 millilitres because the bottle is very deceiving. That's great. So I thought I would try this and see if it does boost your hair a bit. And there's the conditioner. So I found the shampoo on the top and then saw the conditioner on the bottom. So shampoo and conditioner and they were a pound each, which I think is really good, isn't it? And then I saw this and thought I would try it. I think this was £2.50. So this was a bit more. I think this is for blonde hair, but I had some um, blondie streaks put in under here because uh, I wanted my hair a little bit lighter because I had well, it lightened up throughout the summer and then the hairdresser uh, lightened it all up because I normally go darker this time of year but I, was, I really quite like the, the lighter streaks. So I've got some highlights under here somewhere. I don't know, they're under there somewhere. They're in my hair. Hang on, let's have a look. Can you see them? Oh, I don't know. There's some kind of highlights. There, I think there's some there. So they're kind of blondie and I thought I would get this to... Um, to give them a bit of a nice colour. So I thought, well, in between my thickening shampoo, I can try this. So it just says on here, for light blonde to medium blonde hair, obviously I'm dark, but I've got the little blondie highlights. And this is rose peach, temporary hair colour. So it might just boost it a little bit. It looks like that, Oh, which I really like kind of that colour. I don't know if that'll make it a bit more, or not, what's the word? Or the new bit, it can't, can it? So I'll try it, it might, um, give it quite a nice tone. I don't really know on the highlighty bits. So in here, there's 200 millilitres, so I'll use that quite sparingly, um, but I just wanted something, you know, I thought it'd be quite nice to try to give my, my little blondy bits a bit of a boost. Um, I always buy these, so it's really quite boring, these turning up in every pound band haul I do, but I, I really enjoy these little bars, and I always have to eat two of them, like I say, and they're only a pound, so you get five of these for a pound. They're high in fibre, less than 700, and, no, less than 75 calories. I just think they're brilliant. I've been using the um, skinny sauces as well, and I think they're, I think they're really good. So I'm trying to lose a couple of pounds before we go away. So I've lost a little bit. I just want to just lose a little bit more, and um, so I'm I'm comfortable. Right. So I've got some sanitary towels and tampax. These were really a really good price. Well, I think these were one fifty. There was a couple. There was some for a pound, but I thought these are really good. And you've got more in them. Was that right? Or was only eight? I don't know, I sold by the packaging, I think. So they were £1.50. And yeah, you get eight, five secure, night, five secure. Oh, size five. I didn't know you had them in. They came in sizes. Extra night secure, up to 12 hour protection. You get eight in there. So they look really good. Um, yeah, I think they were one fifty. These ones were a pound, the body form ones. I also like the ones you get from Home Bargains. I think they're two for a pound, or they used to be. They're really good, but I haven't been to Home Bargains. Um, so I just, yeah, I just grabbed these while I saw them. So you get 12 in this one, they're a pound body form. These are just the normal ones, aren't they? Just like normal sanitary towels. And then these were a pound each, these um, Tampax Pearl Compact things. So I got a couple of them because it's good for a pound, isn't it? Sometimes they can be really expensive. So yeah, there's eight in each pack and they were a pound each. Um, but I normally just get like the, the Tesco ones are like, I think they're 77p. I think they're called Spirit or something. But they're, they're really good as well. But I just thought, actually, I'll get some of those while they're still a pound. And then I got some blister plasters for Toby because when he plays, he plays a lot of football. And, you know, when he has like new um, new football boots or if he sort of does a bit too much, then he always needs um, a blister plaster. And these can be quite expensive, uh, like the other version. 
it's like the posh versions, but these are really good. They're quite tricky to, oh, maybe they're not. There's one that we bought, I bought some of these blister plasters and they were really hard to, there was different parts to peel, but hopefully these ones will be okay. And you get five in here. They're hydraulicoid plasters. Um, so I'll put these in his football bag so he can use them if he needs them. But they are just so handy to have rather than, you know, soldering on with a saw, with a blister or a saw foot, you can sort yourself out. I'm going to show you the Christmas gifts at the end. And I've got a lovely um, reed diffuser. Well, I've got two of them because uh, I think they're going to smell really nice. I've got two of them. Um, but I got a packet of these um, fast drying furniture pens. Oh, Rufus, he's having a good old snore because I bought a lovely um, like vintage table and it's quite dark and it does have scratches on the top. It was from a car boot sale. It was only two quid, so it was really cheap, um, but it has got some scratches, but I really like the colour of it. So I'll probably use, I'll try and um, sort the scratches out with one of these pens. It's probably one of these, could even be that one. I think they were a pound. I'm pretty sure they were a pound. So I'll try those and, and see what they're like. I have used the grout pen from um Poundland you know the grout pen you do if you have white grout we got it in our downstairs bathroom and it's a really bad choice actually but I have used the grout pen and it it, it works and that's only a pound from Poundland and it brings it up um you know really bright white probably have to do it a couple of times a year but it it does look really good actually it takes the grout grout back to white so hopefully that'll be just as good and this is probably the best value product in this haul it's a dustpan and brush just in case you couldn't tell from, you know, looking at it. And it just says here, swept away dustpan and brush with a bamboo handle. And I didn't have the price when I was looking, but I, I like the look of it. And I took it to the till and the lady said, um, they were only a pound. So I was like, that's so good. With a bamboo handle, dustpan and brush, it looks really good. And it was a pound for the two. So I was really impressed with that. It's kind of a pale gray. Yeah, I just love the bamboo handle. So I got two of them. And it's got a little um, rope as well up here. How good is that for a pound? I think that is brilliant. I know it's not the most exciting thing in the world ever, but that's so good for a quid. I also got some, um, uh, what are these called? You know, cosmetic pads, cotton wool pads. They were, I think they were a pound. And there is 80 in here. I'm gonna give Rufus a gravy bowl. Hang on. Rufus, do you want a gravy bowl? I've got Rufus to jump up on the chair so you could see him. Rufus, do you want a gravy bowl? Do you want a gravy bone? What's this? Oh, I just walked into the, uh, the, um, yeah, the bar stool. Rufus! There you go. I'm going to go back in his bed now. There goes little Rufus. Yeah, he's going to eat his gravy bone in his bed. Right, so what else have I got to show you here? Some, oh, I'll do the reed diffusers, then the Christmas gifts. So I saw these in a different pound land. So I went to one of the town centre and I saw these and some like plug-in bits, but I really like the look of these um, reed diffusers. So I got two of them and I think most of it was sold out actually. It's obviously been quite popular, this Stacey Solomon um, range. So this is Winter Walks limited edition with notes of fresh pine infused with natural oils. Um, so they had, yeah, a few different things and I bet it's gonna smell lovely. So it's all Christmassy, I think, Wood Winter Walks. And it says, um, Winter walks for up to four weeks. So yeah, it just says Airwick Reed Diffuser uses natural rattan stems to um, delicately, delicately diffuse wonderful fragrance. So I have a little sniff. So I've just put the sticks in here and it does smell nice. It's not overly, um, overly strong. I've got another one that I got from Next from the charity shop and that's really strong. So I've put that like as you come in in the hall, but hopefully these will, um, yeah, you know, give off a good, good aroma. So I got two of those. I think they were three pounds fifty. I'm onto the Christmas gift, so I've got a couple of things, um, just a few things here. So I got these for Toby, but don't worry, if he doesn't watch these videos, he won't see this. So these are just little stocking fillers for Toby. He loves links. He thinks it's brilliant. Um, so I got him this little set. Well, there's two of them. He does like a little gift set like this. So there is a uh, in here. You got hair wash. Um, well, it's three in one, so body face and hair wash and a deodorant body spray as well. So I've got him this little box that I'll put away for Christmas. And this little one, I think these are three pounds each or 350, something like that. So this is a little like Christmas cracker thing. And you've got some socks in there and another deodorant. So this is um, size seven to 11 
for the socks so just in case you know if you're wondering what size they are I did have a little look so link socks and deodorant and body spray and um body wash or three in one for toby and then just a couple of little bits so i got these for lee just little daft things these were these were a pound each but i actually think they're really good especially for a pound so this is a multi-tool pen and it's got digital stylus i don't even know what that is actually so i don't know it's got a screwdriver what's a digital stylus if you know let us know put it in the comments a spirit level that's clever that's really good spirit level a ruler and a ballpoint pen so a multi-tool pen for lee it's a little silly thing to wrap up and then i saw this the wallet hero thing i don't think i've seen these before and this kind of got loads of uses so this is a pound as well this just goes obviously in your wallet because it's a wallet hero and it's a box opener a letter opener a ruler a can opener a peeler what would you peel oh like what like potatoes must be a phone stand it says mobile phone stand insert credit card into the slot so that must obviously keep i don't know keep the phone upright spanners and a screwdriver so that is um very clever so hopefully he'll like that oh and a bottle opener there as well which is um which is good isn't it all of that in this one little you know really thin metal thing tool so hopefully you'll like that and the last thing i'm going to show you is this really cute little soap on a sleigh i think that was what it was called um on the shelf i nearly didn't get it and then i thought oh lee's sister would probably love this little soap on a sleigh because she uses lots of soap and it's just really pretty isn't it it's a really sweet little gift and it smells lovely the smell coming out from the packaging so it says forest wild winter berries soap bar on a little sleigh there it's just really really cute so i'm not going to open it up because it's a gift but how sweet is that just a little extra something oh i thought i would um get for lee's sister she doesn't watch these videos either by the way so don't worry i'm not spoiling any surprises but that is lovely isn't it so they had some really nice things actually they had some bath products um in kind of i think they were like a what's the like brown bottles there was um a bath soap and something else they look really nice i think they're around four pounds or three pounds i didn't get those but i just thought i would get this but they had some lovely gift ideas in poundland some really nice things if you um you know you're having a look if you want to get some things here and there so it's not such a you know such an um a big amount to spend all in one go so i'll put these all away into a, I've got a Christmas bag and I'm going to put it in my cupboard so no one can see. So you've got to hide your things as well, but not hide them too well because then you'll forget where they are. So yeah, I'll put them in. I've got a Christmas bag, so I'll put them back in there and um, and then wrap them up near the time. So that is the end of the video. I really hope you enjoyed it. So it's a bit varied. It's not the biggest haul I've ever done, but just some different things. It's nice to see what's in Poundland. And I love my local Poundland. I love going in there because the managers are so nice and it's um it's always really well stocked great yarmouth um gapton retail park it's so nice in there and um yeah everything is put out beautifully and it's always really well presented and it's always quite quiet as well i tend to go in the morning but it's really quiet and you kind of get the place to wander around by yourself i think i was in there for about half an hour this morning having a look around so yeah i enjoyed that they had some really cute mugs as well by the way i didn't get any i'm going to put a couple of pictures on instagram on kate mccabe instagram which i'll link below just in case you're not following there and i've got a house account as well called kate george and home so i'll link those below so there's some really cute mugs um some christmas mugs and glass mugs i actually have loads of glass mugs i bought them last year from matalan but these ones were really they were two pounds in poundland they're just really lovely with little christmas designs on so i'll shove them on my instagram um story so you can have a look at those really cute and i'll put it in a highlight as well like bargain finds they were really cute and they had some cookie jars and just some really nice things i had a lovely look around this morning at all the christmas stuff but that is the end of the video so i really hope you enjoyed it if you did make sure you uh, subscribe and give the video a like as well and let me know your favorite item so add it in the comments below what you like the most mine's got to be i think it's a dustpan and brush i think that's a I think that's great i really do and i also think this is so cute like the little soap on a sleigh is just gorgeous and is there anything else i can smell this it smells really nice actually it's not overpowering at all it's just really sort of i don't know if i really describe it but it just smells really nice but without being too i suppose artificial or 
it just smells lovely. I, I really like that. I can smell that. I thought it was the soap. Or maybe it's a combination of both. I think it's actually that um the um, reed diffuser. And I look forward to uh I'm looking forward to trying these as well, these products. I might have big big hair out there this time. Uh oh. Oh no! I'm just knocked on the floor and I'm just oh uh oh. Uh oh, it'll be fine. So yeah, I might have really big hair next time you see me. And I'll have some plastic stuffed in my feet as well. Um, so that's the end. Thanks so much for watching. I'll speak to you next week. I've got a charity shop haul for next week. And then I think I'm going to do a Christmas haul of stuff I've, um, you know, got for Christmas and some gifts and different things and decorations. So that'll be probably the video after that. So they're the next couple of videos coming up. But have a lovely weekend and I shall speak to you soon. Take care. Bye bye.